Welcome back troglodytes to the Trogly's Guitar Show. I thought I would make an official video outlining the generations of the greatest case ever made, the Gibson Chainsaw Case. Now I've been wanting to make this video since 2000 subscribers, but there's just so much confusion when people are listing their guitars as to what generation they have. So let's go ahead and dive into it. There are three official generations to the chainsaw case. This is the first one. Identifying characteristics of this one are two plastic latches on the front, a padded handle, and a red interior. Something that not all generation ones have are these extra bits of padding right here. This version of the case also has less padding at the top of the case. However, the key identifying characteristic here is the two plastic latches from the factory. The Generation 1 chainsaw case is actually the most rare and most sought after by collectors. Even though it's more sought after, as a case it is technically inferior to Generation 2. And here's why. Gibson added a third back latch. These cases are also a little bit more plush. The interior compartment of the case is also a little bit different, but again, the biggest identifying characteristic here is the three plastic latches. This version of the case also originally had a lid ribbon to help protect your hinges over the years. However, it's actually very rare to find that still attached. So generation one and two are very similar cases. They are both what I consider the best case ever made. However, unless you like having a really rare case that wasn't made for too long, go for a generation two simply because it has the three latches. These plastic latches are known for breaking. However, in my experience with them, if you take the time to latch them properly, you will never have any issues with them failing. The Generation 2 case lasted until about 1980, 1981. And then in comes Generation 3. The least loved of the chainsaw cases because it has been completely redesigned. Generation 1 and 2 were made out of a material called Asdel, whereas these are just a molded plastic material. These cases are roughly twice as thick as the original chainsaw cases, so if you're storing a large collection in these, you're going to need a big room. However, something this version has over the first two generations is metal latches. And that's why some people prefer this one, is because they're scared of the plastic latches breaking. Another feature that was lost on Generation 3 is you don't have a padded handle anymore. It's just a plastic material. However, it is still fairly comfortable. The interior of these cases are also a little bit more colorful. Instead of just red, you could choose between a brown color, blue, and black. Now these also originally had lid ribbons as well. There's also an honorary Generation 4 chainsaw case. That's when they took all the padding out of Gen 3 and just did felt lining. Those things are garbage. They even took away this little compartment lid right here. There was also an acoustic chainsaw case made. So I hope this video helps you identify which chainsaw case you have so you can advertise it correctly. If you see somebody that's advertising theirs as the wrong generation, send them this video. I would love to see a day where everybody gets the generations correct. Thank you Travel Dice for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and we will see you tomorrow on the next episode. Take care.